Hi, I'm Brandy. This is Hound Dog Hollow, and today I'm going to be unboxing my second I Am Alchemy box. Comes in this beautiful purple box. So let's check it out. I love the inside. Beautiful. Ooh, sacred sexuality. Wow. We'll get back to that. Crystal cluster. Tells you more about that. This box smells lovely. Oh, it's a woman. I embrace my sexuality. My sexuality is sacred. My body is sacred. I honor and respect my body. I enjoy the sensations in my body. I feel pleasure in my body. I feel sensual in my body. Word. There we go. Sorry about that. Pretty. Ooh, sacred union. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. A little kiss. Ah, ooh. I hate messing it up. It smells really yum. Crystal infusion in Nana's Temple Priestess. Aphrodisiac. Pink tourmaline. Tourmaline. Ooh, pink tourmaline. Gem infused herbal tea. What did it say? I said go out to the living room. <laughs> my son is a Hellion. And it looks like my husband just got him. <laughs> so rose incense ropes. <laughs> this beautiful bag. Oh, oh, pretty. Lovely little conch sale, which reminds you of a woman's vulva, I think. <laughs> At least that's what the Blue Lagoon taught me. If you guys are old like me, you know what that movie is. Ooh. Wow. Ishtar's Sacred Flame. Beautiful. Ooh, it's sparkly and it smells amazing. I love this. Whoa. Cool. Oh wow. Love goddess. Pink tourmaline. Pink tourmaline and gem infused soap. Oh, it smells weird. Made, made with pink tourmaline gem essence. Blend of essential oils. Detergent free coconut milk soap base. Beetroot. I knew it. Beets. Beetroot powder, raspberry powder, matter root powder, rose hip powder, rose clay. Oh, not a clay, too. Pink tourmaline infused organic red rose petals. It doesn't smell bad. I just got like a whiff of something very like familiar. And I think it's the rose petals and the beets and the rose hips. I don't know. But it smells good. We got this. Let's see what we got here. If it's a stone, I'm guessing it's pink tourmaline. Yeah. The second one of these I've got this month, um, which is still nice. I have a whole bunch of them though. Beautiful. It's a big one. What do we got here? Ooh. Ooh. Kiss of Venus, pink tourmaline gem infused beauty mist. Ooh, I think it's rose water-ish. Pink tourmaline, gem essence, rose water, essential hydrosol, geranium water, essential hydrosol. Oh, rose water, essential hydrosol, geranium water, essential hydrosol, witch hazel, and sorbic acid, which is a preservative. It's got like little crystals. Mm, this one smells like rose petals to me. It's moisture. So I'm putting it on. Cool. All right. Last item. See if we can make it through here without my excited four-year-old barging in and wreaking havoc. Aphrodite's Desire. Aphrodisiac. Pink tourmaline infused herbal elixir. Brandy. Red rose petals, organic oat straw, 
organic vanilla rooibos, rooibos, organic epimedium leaf, organic oat tops, organic damiana leaf, organic cardamom, organic ginger root, organic maca powder, organic lotus stamens, organic orange peel, organic roasted cacao nibs, organic cacao powder, pure vanilla extract, raw unfiltered organic honey. Let's smell this stuff. I've never got enough food. Woo! <laughs> it smells like I can smell the brandy a lot. <laughs> Let's give it. <laughs> Let's give that a little tiny taste. Mmm, tastes sweet. Yum. <laughs> All right, this is amazing. Let's look at what we got here. Thank you for joining us on a very intimate and sacred leg of our journey. This work is deep and can be intimidating at times. The key is to be patient with yourself and most important, try to have fun. Blessing and love to you all. Sacred sexuality. Some information there. More information. So pink quartz, pink tourmaline is a quartz. Pink tourmaline in quartz is a perfect stone to work with when working on embracing your sacred sexuality and your inner divine feminine. It will help you remember that you're worthy of love, forgiveness, or encouragement. And basically, there's a lot of stuff in here. I don't usually read the whole thing unless it's got descriptions about all the items. Which I, oh, there we go. This one's the description of all the items. So this is the crystal cluster, which is their big box. <laughs> Raw, natural, pink tourmaline and quartz. Tea of the month is ananas. Temple Priestess Gem Infused Aphrodisiac Tea. Pretty cool. That's this one. Their teas are just really pretty in little iridescent bags. Divine Feminine Amulet, which is this beautiful little conch and goddess. The amulet has been infused with gem essence and blessed under the full moon. The mystical cowrie shell is small, white, and glossy, resembling the female life-giving organ that is an amulet, which increases fertility and gives life. As women, we often become the caretakers of those around us and leave little to no time for ourselves. When we, ha when we do have time to do something for ourselves, we feel guilty or feel the need to ask permission to indulge ourselves in some self-love. The goddess charm is there to remind you that, uh, that there is a goddess inside of you, a goddess that yearns for the luxurious touch of a scented oil massage or to be lost in the ecstasy of the senses. Ishtar Sacred Flame Candle. Gem infused and blessed under the full moon, this candle was anointed with love essential oil blend, hand crushed rose petals, and adorned with gold reminiscent of the gold that adorns the temple of the goddess and her beloved priestesses. Aphrodite's Desire Aphrodisiac Gem Infused Herbal Lifter. Keep in a cool, dark place. Shake lightly before use. Place a dropper full in a glass of wine or water or directly into mouth and enjoy a romantic night with your partner or alone exploring what brings you pleasure. Kiss of Venus Gem Infused Body Mist. It can be used to set makeup or as a toner after washing your face. Or if you would just like to raise your vibrations, there's no limits to how you can use it. Handmade Nepali Rose Incense. I love these things. I'm collecting them now. Made in Kathmandu, Nepal. Can be burned in an abalone shell. Ashtray, large incense burner, or tempered glass jar. And it has a link to YouTube videos. Affirmation card, which I love. That's this one. I'm collecting these. And an oracle reading. This has been a great box. I love this box. This is a really fun box. I highly recommend it to you. This is um, I Am Alchemy. This is their Crystal Cluster box. They are a great company. I've raved about them before. This is my second box that I've, the Crystal Cluster box that I've gotten. And I've gotten a Crystal Point box. And they are fabulous, whimsical, all sorts of different things. You guys know that I get lots and lots of different boxes. And yet, this is so new, unique. Like, I just, I'm in awe of it. I really love the whimsy. I really love the attention to detail, the care, and the theming. So I invite you to check it out. There's a link um, in the description box below. Thank you guys so much for all your support. I really, I really am humbled by the outreach and the comments and the likes and just my subscribers. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much for everything. I can't wait to keep going on this journey with you. Stay tuned because there's going to be a couple more giveaways coming up. Uh, Balmy Box 
and um, Witch's Roots box. And otherwise, thank you so much. I hope you have a wonderful day. As always, tell me what you think. Give me some comments. Give me some likes. If you haven't already, please subscribe. And I look forward to seeing you. Have a good day. Good night.